Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the channel. If you want to share attachments to your SharePoint account and store those attachments, I'm going to show you exactly how to do it. Now, there's a few ways of going through the process, and um, I'm going to show you a bunch of different ways so that you can figure out which one is going to suit your needs the best. So without further ado, let's climb straight into this. So what you can do is go into the email where you've received your attachments and what you can do is you can drop this menu down here and you can download them. Okay, so once you've downloaded your attachments, you can go into your SharePoint and let's go to documents. Now you see over here, I've got email attachments. I can go in here and now I can upload from here. So this will access my file explorer and I can upload those attachments right to here but there is another way of doing this so what you will need is Microsoft Teams okay you'll have this connected to your SharePoint so what you're gonna do from your email this is the email here and you'll see over here there's apps and it gives you the option to share to teams and what essentially will happen now is you will have an email sent to your Microsoft Teams account now what it'll look like from here in your Microsoft Teams account is just over here, you'll see just under general, you can now choose where it gets sent to. So this is it here. And we are gonna say share, make sure that include attachments is obviously selected. And you'll find that that's what it looks like. So what you can see here is these files, you can click down and you can actually drag them over and you can go into your SharePoint account and you can drop them right over here. All right, but again, that's one way of doing it, but there is another way. You're gonna come over here to the top and you're gonna to go to documents and you will see your attachments in documents. So let's just go into general over here and email messages. So you will now see your email messages and here are the attachments. So let us select the attachments that we would like to add now. And you can see it says move to, let's click that. And here it says moving three items and you can go down, it says quick access and let's select this how to harbor. Now just remember this is our SharePoint site. Okay, and we can now see email attachments. This is our folder over here. We're gonna click on email attachments, we're in here. And we're gonna click move here. Now this is synced, so within the next few seconds, it'll show up here. You may just have to refresh your page and you will see your attachments over here. There you go, quick and easy and multiple ways to get the job done. So one thing to note is that you need to make sure that Microsoft Teams is actually connected to your SharePoint. So um, in SharePoint, you can go ahead and connect it. All you need to do is jump into the App Store in SharePoint and you'll be able to now add Microsoft Teams to SharePoint. And this way you'll be able to sync your email attachments directly to SharePoint.